You may know us by another name, Eclipseville, or as the people around West Kentucky call us, Hoptown. By any name, Hopkinsville is a mix of diverse folks proud to share our many community strengths, activities, and achievements. Do you know about our rich agricultural heritage? Or what about our world-class Fort Campbell Army base? You might have heard of Hopkinsville from our array of national and international industries carried by our strong local work ethic. Whether it's farming, industry, or one of our heritage events like the International Festival or Trail of Tears powwow, we're proud to call Hoptown home. We think our community has what it takes to be an all-America city. Hoptown and Christian County are one of Kentucky's largest agricultural engines. Corn, wheat, soybean, and tobacco are mainstays on 350,000 acres spread over 12,000 beautiful farms. Hopkinsville and Fort Campbell have been inseparable since 1942. Home of the storied 101st Airborne Division, Christian County is a nationally recognized Great American Defense Community. Hopkinsville's robust industrial base features 21 international companies from 11 nations. From food processing to auto parts, our cutting edge industries are powered by our strong regional and local workforces. In Hoptown, we like to play together. In 2017, we were dubbed Eclipseville and welcomed over 116,000 worldwide guests to celebrate the great American solar eclipse. A vibrant downtown art scene, new and expanding park and athletic facilities all make Hopkinsville a regional destination for cultural and events. Hopkinsville, Kentucky, we're a true picture of rural America, blessed with a mix of fine folks sharing their experiences from all over. Let us take you on a tour of Hopkinsville's Diversity University. We're so glad to have you here at Diversity University and look forward to showing you around. Today's campus tour will provide you a much clearer understanding of Hopkinsville, Kentucky, and the unique assortment of opportunities and abundance of rich history that we've enjoyed since 1797. Is everybody ready for the tour? Yeah. At Diversity University, we want your experience to truly be out of this world. Although our community size of 31,000 may be relatively small in stature, we proved in 2017 that anything is possible with the right approach and true teamwork. As the point of greatest eclipse that summer, the stars truly aligned for us as Hopkinsville transformed into Eclipseville, embracing and capitalizing on the celestial opportunity of a lifetime. Hopkinsville was put on the map across the globe, leading up to our moment in the sun on August 21st, 2017. And when the two minutes and 40 seconds of darkness was complete, we proved our ability to shine by welcoming 116,000 visitors from 47 states and 25 countries. We hope you'll consider choosing Diversity University, where we eclipse your expectations and always encourage you to shoot for the stars. Both of my parents attended Diversity University and always talk about how much they enjoyed staying involved with the DU family. Why is this so important to them? One of the most important aspects of any college campus is the involvement and generosity of its alumni base, and no one does it better than DU. A recent philanthropy.com report showed that Hopkinsville is hands down the most giving city in Kentucky. Despite a modest per capita income, our community never hesitates to help others. For example, the Indian Physicians Alliance for Community Service felt so welcomed that they donated $200,000 over five years to nonprofit organizations and programs. Additionally, our United Way of the Penny Row campaign, funded by community donations, has been consistently successful. We also have an abundance of civic clubs and organizations that raise money, collect toys, provide meals, assist less fortunate, and reminds us all of the importance of our fellow man. We hope you'll contribute this same com community of giving during and after your time at DU. What all is there for me to do on campus? What a great question, one that I am more than happy to answer. You see, several years back, our local government and city council approved a $21 million initiative called WINS. It stands for Wellness Infrastructure Neighborhoods Leads to Success, and it's led to a lot of success for our residents. Implementation of this initiative is still on its way, but includes a 55,000 square foot sportsplex, a two mile addition to the Greenway system, which will soon feature the longest pedestrian bridge over land in the state of Kentucky. Also includes sidewalk construction to six acres of new parks and recreation throughout our community. 
You see, there's also going to be a new Ag Expo facility, a 44,000 Ag Expo facility. There's also a continued improvement to our downtown area, including the Alhambra Theater and the Pinaral Air Museum. So quite frankly, there's plenty to do for nearly everyone here at Diversity University, someone from all walks of life, from every background. And that's why we're excited for you to explore our campus and beyond. I'm from very far away. This is actually my first time to Hopkinsville, and I wonder if Diversity University will be able to understand and adapt to my culture. Our goal at Diversity University is to make you feel right at home, no matter where you're from or what background you have. We're also home to the Hopkinsville Human Rights Commission, a group that advocates, unifies, promotes, and protects. HRC is committed to eliminating discriminatory practice, pursuing social equity, and assisting with landlord-tenant rights and other potential legal scenarios that affect our basic civil and human rights. It is vital that we continue to work to find and encourage unity in our community, whether that's a celebration or a conversation, a playful proceeding, or a peaceful protest. We care about our neighbors in Hopkinsville, and we want them to succeed. Grace and Mercy is a faith-based transitional recovery home for women coming from incarceration, homelessness, and women in crisis. We combine evidence-based practices with the principles of the Bible, and guess what? It works. Our focuses are the three R's, rehabilitation, over 50 psychoeducational classes, reunification by knowing their identity in Christ, restoration, wellness, and sober living. One of our graduates has exemplified all the tools given to her, but let me give, you her, let me give her the opportunity to tell you herself. I am Daniel Myers, and at my time at Grace and Mercy has led to a life transformation for me. Thanks to rational behavior and warm Christian support, I no longer am where I was. Before Grace and Mercy, I led a life of carjacking, drug addiction, jails, prisons, and loneliness. Since Grace and Mercy, I've developed a relationship with the Lord, reunited with my children and family, gotten my GED, begun classes at HCC, where I am the president of Phi Theta Kappa. I have a home where I pay my bills and am a contributing member of society. I'm so grateful for Grace and Mercy. We go to all lengths necessary to cater for our uni diversity university community. This is evident in the accomplishments of two very special entities in Hopkinsville. The first is our local Boys and Girls Club. With programs and activities that focus on academic success, healthy lifestyles, and character development, the Boys and Girls Club serves nearly 1,200 school-age youth each year. During the pandemic, the Boys and Girls Club provided virtual programming and over 43,000 meals and snacks to youth in our community. The other is Challenge House. Six Challenge Houses found in under-resourced neighborhoods throughout our city are homes to local ambassadors. From these challenge houses, ambassadors and volunteers teach and tutor, love and nurture, and bring a sense of belonging to our inner city neighbors. This relocation ministry has worked wonders over the years. I can already tell that I'm going to love it here at Everest University, but what if I don't have enough money or scholarships to afford it? We want you here, and we will work to make sure that that happens. In fact, Hopkinsville Rotary Club annually holds the largest Rotary International Fundraiser in the world to fulfill a Rotary Scholars Program partnership with Hopkinsville Community College, allowing all local and qualified high school graduates to earn two years of tuition-free education at HCC. Since its inception in 2012, the Rotary Scholars Program has provided hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of education and opportunity to over 800 recipients. You see, in Hopkinsville, we understand that our young people truly are the future, which is why we work diligently to provide and invest in the well-being of our next generations. Wow, I'm so blown away with everything I've heard and seen today. It's so evident that Hopkinsville is the perfect home for anyone, including me. So how do I get in? I'm really glad to hear you say that, Donovan. And furthermore, I'm grateful to all of you for deciding to visit our amazing campus today. As mayor of Hopkinsville, it's imperative that I set an example of inclusion in our community. I do this by listening and by welcoming all points of view. And by striving to lead our community through this challenging time, times with passion and do so with respect. Donovan, if you and your peers here today really want to get into Diversity University, our price is very reasonable. We simply ask for your sincerity and a genuine approach to how you interact with others around you. 
Should you ultimately decide to choose diversity university, please understand one thing. This is not just a place where you come to study for a few years. This will become your new home, a safe place, a place where you can live and grow and learn with confidence, confidence in our all American city, Hopkinsville, Kentucky. We are Hopkinsville, Kentucky, and we are all America city. All right.